St. Mary's Church in the main market square of Krakow holds one of the greatest treasures in this part of the continent, the monumental altar of the Dormition of the Blessed Virgin Mary, sculpted by Weitz Doss. His arrival to Krakow from Nuremberg in 1477 marked a breakthrough for the ancient capital of Poland. His work made the city one of the principal centers of late Gothic sculpture in Central Europe. It took some 12 years to carve the altarpiece for St. Mary's. It originally stood 18 meters high and 11 meters wide. The cost, borne by the citizens of Kraków, equaled the city's annual budget. The altar boasts two pairs of wings. The central figure is the patron of the church, the Virgin Mary. Weitzdorf had residents of medieval Kraków sitting as models for the altar. Presented highly naturalistically, their bodies show various defects and imperfections. Even today, it is a source of knowledge of the culture, custom and history of the city. The altar has been repaired and cleaned several times since the mid-16th century. To protect it from damage in September 1939, it was disassembled and floated down the Vistula on barges. Intercepted by the Nazis, it was taken to Berlin. After the Second World War, it was discovered by the Americans in a bunker under Castle Hill in Nuremberg. Recovered in 1946, it was returned to Krakow. W 2015 roku rozpoczęliśmy w Bazylice Mariackiej w Krakowie konserwację ołtarza. Trwała 6 lat. Prowadzili ją dla nas specjaliści Akademii Sztuk Pięknych. With respect to the high standing of the item and the needs of the liturgy, the altar could not be decommissioned from operation. Work was set up in a makeshift workshop behind the altar, inside the basilica, and continued for over 1,000 days. Special scaffolding was built in front of the altar so that visitors and the faithful alike could see what the conservators were doing. Their work extended to over 200 figures and several thousand separate wooden elements. Conservation performed by the experts from the Academy of Fine Arts in Krakow was based on a holistic view of the work and used a full spectrum of scientific possibilities. Since 2021, it has been possible to admire this sculptural gem without any later additions, as the original gilding and polychrome painting were uncovered. Bazylika Mariacka wraz z jej ołtarzem jest częścią wpisanego w 1978 roku na listę światowego dziedzictwa UNESCO historycznego centrum Krakowa. Ten bezcenny zabytek jest ciągle żywym dziedzictwem nie tylko Krakowa, nie tylko Polski, ale i Europy i świata. Jako opiekunowie mamy przywilej i obowiązek troszczyć się o to dzieło, stąd decyzja o rozpoczęciu projektu była dla nas oczywista. Dzieło Wita Stwosza trwa dzięki zaangażowaniu dziesiątek osób w proces konserwacji. Wiemy, że nasze zaangażowanie nie kończy się dzisiaj. Dlatego ciągle ważne jest budowanie świadomości dziedzictwa na poziomie międzynarodowym.